Man, you better call in the hearse, cause I'm about to go straight for your bitch's purse. Man, you decide what's worse, me being in the hood or doing no good? I already told you, give me a job. I'm looking, I'm praying, I'm looking to God and I swear to God I'm saying. But it seems he's don't answer. Still I sit here like a soul snowman, sir. Man, I'm so insecure, but I still pause. Like a bear with no paws, I'm not going to be able to fish. But like I said, I'm not going to waste my time on no wish. Zero, selfhood, on the infinite horizon, we create technologies to reflect human nature, they backlash a ruling nature, nature, the natural, physical, material world or universe, a human being is part of the universe, limited in time and space, an optical delusion of consciousness. The eternal equinox fell squarely upon her birthday. It is topologically elusive, networked universe, the one we operate in. Footprint mind, choices forecast. Nootropics aid cognitive functions to enact predicted behavior in the future. Nourish the mind-body with goji berries and meditate to succumb to the illusion of self-care, self-help, self-esteem, self-reference, self-assessment, self-employment, selfies, selfhood. The self, which equates data exchange, is a profitable asset. Optimind, 5-HTP, Neuromaster, 
mind lab pro, hydrofinal, alpha brain, kettle prime. One, intelligent personal assistant. The economies of affect develop novel user interfaces. Intrinsic seamless interaction, fingertips and polymer membranes, skin and silicon in hybrid organics. Sight and haptics give way to language and voice. The voice interface encapsulates projection of affect onto consumer products. Anthropomorphized technologies with a compliant tone lure a sense of intimacy. Artificial intelligence embeds crevices in its disembodied manifestations. Automated response simulations leak patriarchal promise. Affective labor oozes through the cracks. Humans and other animals are genetically predisposed to react to a voice similar to a primary caregiver's. Such attachment bond to a sentient female voice is developed in the early stages of infancy. This is my voice coming from within my body and mind, but how do I speak as us? The body is but voice coming my, as and from us. How my mind, I speak this within. Two, the self. Battery, 26. Display. 25 Aluminium 24 Stainless steel 23 Glass 16 Circuit boards 11 Plastic 7 Other 6 Other 6G Other 6 grams Other The self needs an other to recognize itself The Western culture self is usually seen as abstract private individual and separates themselves from the rest of the group. An Eastern culture self might be presented as open and flexible. This behavior of neural networks is sometimes called dreaming. The human brain is still not fully understood. Neuroscience uses third-person perspective for scientific observations well favoring first-person stance for definitions of mental phenomena. It views the biological basis as closely related to the psychology of self. This is my voice coming from within my body and mind, but how do I speak as us? Changes instantly reward my multiplex edges from thorax to nostrils, from tentacles to scales. Contracting our extensions against external forces, I attempt to remember a collective narrative. Three, the quantum self. Karen Barrett deconstructs the self on personal and on subatomic levels through quantum field theory, sight. All matter, in its essence, is a massive overlaying of others, other beings, other spaces, other times, an infinity of infinities. All touching entails an infinite alterity, so that touching the other is touching all others, including the self. And touching the self entails touching the stranger within. Oxygen, 65%. Carbon, 18%. Hydrogen, 10%. Nitrogen, 3%. Calcium, 1.5%. Phosphorus, 1%. Potassium, 0.25%. Sulfur, 
electrons are inherently chimeras, cross pieces, cross time mixtures, made of virtual configurations, beings dispersed across space and time. The point particle without structure is a patchwork of time sutured together in uncanny configurations. The snow blasted along the side of the bridge. It was shredded, like lace after an attack from hyperactive kittens. 4. A datified self. Our datified selfhood resides in a statistical matrix of forged subjectivity. Data defines our profiling by the logic of the market. The crafted circulation is accompanied by physical transformation. The vast amounts of aggregated data through presuming has resulted in it becoming the ultimate, yet elusive currency. Migration, mutability and statistical abstraction enable its camouflage. In line with the ontological dualism proposed by the Occident, the immateriality of data disguises its value in the cloud. 5. Quantified self. Collecting personal informatics can be viewed as a biopolitical act of self-surveillance. The quantified self personifies the politics of data flows. It describes a culture of self-tracking collecting personal data by monitoring and analyzing habits, mental and physiological functions.
wasn't much to do after the floods except drink that sumptuous primal spine. $1,750? Oh my god! Oh my god! What? Oh! What? Today I am determined to see that I am not a body, that I am free. Today I'm determined to see that I am not a body, I am free. Today I am determined to see that I am not a body, I am free. I am as God created me. <clears throat> Today I'm determined to see that I am not a body, I am free. Today I am determined to see that I am not a body, that I am free. I am as God created me. Today I am determined to see that I am not a body, I am free. I am as God 
created me. Again, today I am determined to see that I am not a body, I am free. I am spirit as God created me. I really follow that I am as God created me. I am really into not being a body. I'm into being free. I'm into being as God created me. I grasp that I'm not a body. I grasp that I'm free. I grasp that I am as God created me. I understand that I'm not a body. I understand that I am free. I understand that I am as God created me. I'm taking it in that I'm not a body, that I'm free, that I am as God created me. I'm soaking it up that I'm a, not a body, that I'm free, that I am as God created me. I'm latching it. I've never been a body. I've always been free. I am the Son of God, and that's all there is to see. That's all there is to see. I've never been a body. I've always been free. I am the Son of God, and that's all there is to see. That's all there is to see. That's all there is to see. I've never been a body. I've always been free. I am a son of God. And uh, that feels real sweet to me. Romantic. It was real. It was two people truly connecting where they had never connected before. And uh, then I woke up. I wish I didn't wake up, but th but that was when I woke up, and I guess that means it's the end of the story. <laughs> <laughs> 